Hi my dear students welcome to our channel learn physics with Gunas sir we are watching our channel first time please subscribe for more updates click the bell icon thank you In our today's class, we are going to explain the Stewart and Key experiment. Aim of the experiment is to study the variation of magnetic field with distance along the axis of circular current carrying a conductor. Required operators are Stewart Key galvanometer. magnetic compass rheostat up to 20 ohms variable commutator ammeter for measure the current battery eliminator as DC source circuit diagram connect the connections as per circuit shown without any loose contacts connect DC power supply positive terminal to the ammeter positive terminal here we are using the ammeter to determine the current. Now observe that rheostat A, B, C three points are there. First of all, we need to connect rheostat terminal A to the DC power supply that means source negative. This is commutator. Four dots in the figure indicates four screws of commutator. Now we will connect rheostat upper, upper terminal C to the commutator. Connect the opposite side screw of commutator to ammeter negative. Now connect the steward gi coil first terminal A and third terminal C to the commutator. In this case R, 50 turns we are connecting for the steward gi galvanometer. Now we will keep this operators in the magnetic meridian. If the axis of the coil is perpendicular to the direction of the axis magnetic field, then that kind of coil is said to be in magnetic meridian. Adjust the arms of the magnetometer until the pointer of compass becomes parallel to it. Rotate the compass until the pointer reads 0, 0. Carefully adjust the rheostat and bring the deflections in the magnetic compass is 6060. tabular form. In the tabular form we are seeing that 
distance theta 1 theta 2 theta 3 theta 4 east direction and west direction also that means here we need to do this experiment in two directions first of all we have to move, move the magnetic compass towards east direction that means east side to a distance of 2 centimeters from the circular coil carrying current readings note down the readings theta 1 theta 2 and plug case position in commutator you need to interchange interchange the plug case note down theta 3 and theta 4 also measure the magnetometer deflections for the distances 4 6 8 centimeters until deflection source 10 degrees both time theta 1 theta 2 and theta 3 theta 4 you need to take and enter in the tabular form now move the magnetometer towards west side to a distance of 2 centimeters you will get theta 5 and theta 6 Interchange the position and note down theta 7 and theta 8. You will get theta 7 and theta 8. Now, do all the calculations by using the formula. Already, whatever the data you have noted down in your tabular form. Draw the graph between position of the compass distance on x axis and tan values on y axis. You will get the graph like this. This is our experiment. Thank you for learning here.